The new approach to this year's TechCon is different from any way we've ever done it before. This year, we're taking away the CME, we're changing the format, we're including a Shark Tank series, making the format more exciting to attendees. We're also increasing the way that we show our attendees new technology by opening up to not just new devices and new te techniques, but also showing our attendees this year new ways of visualizing your surgery, perhaps a holographic projection of your case as you're getting ready to do it. They'll see technologies that they've heard about potentially in trials either in the United States or abroad and finally get an update on where things stand and, and start to begin to hear about technologies from new inventions, uh, new companies that they may have not heard about in the past. So this will really allow them to start understanding what's on the forefront, how the practices will change over the next three to five years. One of the really exciting opportunities in TechCon is to have a robotic session where we'll be teaching you the standard Da Vinci intuitive new technology coming out with the XI, but we're also introducing all of the new competitive robots that are coming down the road. We'll be showing you about new haptic technology, new enabling devices that de decrease stress when you're doing minimally invasive surgery, new stapling technology, and new minimally invasive access procedures. We'll be focusing specifically in thoracic on new ways to treat lung cancer, going potentially with a percutaneous access to ablate tumors in a way that it's never been done per before. For aortic diseases, um, there's been a recent uh, push and innovation to start stent grafting in both the arch and the ACE and the aorta. There are several trials that have uh, started enrollment in the United States and abroad and we'll hear about where, where things stand with stent grafting in these uh, gray zones and more challenging zones uh, and see where that's headed in the future. For the aortic valve session, in addition to hearing about some of the new aortic valves and TAVR valves that are coming, there will be a, a large focus on the debate of what will the role of the cardiac surgeon be in TAVRs in the next five years. With the mitral valve, there will be two large sections, one based on the new technologies with transcatheter mitral repair, and the other based on uh, new technologies with transcatheter replacement. We hope that you come to TechCon, because if you do, you'll be up to date on the latest, greatest things coming out in our own industry.